Yes, lads, what's going on? Dono here. And today is a big episode. More transfers coming in. in I'm not going to spoil it, but some massive wins in the league. We go up in the um, league. Episode 3. Let's just get into it, shall we? Come on. Come on the town. Come on the career mode. If you're liking the career mode, hit the like button, subscribe, and let's try to get to 25 subs. Come on! Right then, this is it. This is where we left off the last episode. We have to play Plymouth Argyle today in our next in our next game. Um, then West Brom, which would be a tough one away, um, and then Cardiff to top it all off today, and obviously deadline day as well. So this is going to be a long episode, boys. So strap in. Get the popcorn and get ready. Off go, I've done some scouting. Um, Jay Sansfield, Lewis Dobbin, Joel Quensa and Carly Chukumweka. They might not all sign, but it's just something to look at for the future. As in, in a few days. Um, obviously, Clark got injured last epi. And, um, yeah, that's... Uh, Brandon Williams wants to talk. Morsey wants to talk. Uh, one thing I will do is um, sort everyone's contracts because that is sh shambles. So I will do that off camera. So you have to watch. Right, last episode, this is where we left off. Um, two assists for two out of 20 for a collar chap chapstick, baby. And two out of 15 for midfield dominance. See if we can get that up today. And yeah, that'll be really big um, for the career if we get them two up and higher, higher. So we don't have to do the forfeits, obviously. So we have done all of the um, all of the contracts, as you can see, only the loans and the people retiring we have to do. But we may sign Brandon Williams and Dane Scarlett in January, we may not. Um, right, we've got to play Plymouth Argyle. Who are a really physical team. We're going to play. Um, because everyone's tired obviously. From the last game. Um, which was the game against. Um, obviously Stoke. Where we obviously lost. 2-1. So we're going to be a really physical team. And the team's fit. So. Cameron Humphrey is going on the left hand side. Um, two physical defenders in there, and we won't concede much today because obviously the full backs may push up, but that's their weakest point. Maybe not Cameron Humphreys, but definitely General Donassian. But he has his moments, General Donassian, so um, maybe, just maybe. We can not necessarily sneak something from Plymouth because we were going to win. I think it could be like a three-one, two-one, maybe. Right? Oh, he's gone. Where's Burns? In the twentieth minute, alive at Portman Road. There's been a goal. Where's Burns? He's through again. He's through again, Burns. There's a few skills. Goes out to Humphreys. Just settles. See if he can cut it back into hum Harness. To Lee Evans. He has a strike. Save by Cooper. Their keeper's good, isn't he? Hardy. Block um, Block Badminton is blocked into the goal. Halaki wouldn't have gone it anyway. Maybe this episode or next, we're going to see a different goal in goal. Because for me, he's been conceding too many. But maybe because of the lack of coaches we've got in, in, in the squad. But yeah. Here's Evo taking the corner. Fridge, oh, fridge. One and one he scores, and the other end he might score. Taylor 
comes off for Amari, which is a big sub because Amari's quick and he will burn their defenders who haven't been very quick this game, especially dealing with West Burns and now Amari. But here's all the substitutions. Amari obviously going to stay on. Morsey coming on for Evo. Not for Evo, for Ball. Um, Broadhead, Jalen Braff coming on. Um, Burns as well coming off f- for Jaden Braff because obviously Amari just changed with just change basically Wes Burns got substituted for Jaden Braff and Braff changed for Amari there you go hey Jaden Braff his first goal for town Jaden Braff celebrates with Janoi Danassian like he's won the World Cup and that is brilliant for his confidence goat of the channel legend scores a goal Against Blue Fargo to possibly win it and to seal the three points. Come on! We needed something like that. We needed that moment of madness from someone in the squad, and Jaden Braff just popped up and got the goal. Brilliant. Just brilliant. Here's Broadhead. In the final minutes of the game, played it to Jaden Braff. Who just does a cheeky turn? Who plays the broadhead? Who shoots? Cooper saves. And this could be the final corner of the game. Morsey takes the corner. He's been doing a few corners recently. His broadhead. Can someone follow it up like Humphreys? No, it, he can't, but doesn't matter anyway because it's 2 1 down, finished. Come on. We've had a few decent results this career mode. We've only had one loss in the league. Which, if you think that's really good. Obviously, not at the Carabao Cup, which is not so good, but... We've got to prepare for this next game, though, which is, um, obviously, West Brom away. We're going to play our, our play a big team today. Clark's going to come back in. Tuan Zabi probably going to play with Wolfie. Um, Leaf, maybe, might play Janoi, um, I'm not sure about that one actually, because Davis, not got the highest energy levels, Berger's going to come for the bench for JD, um, Jackson going to come onto the bench, um, and yeah, much the same as last, last, no, not actually much the same, much the same as the, um, Stoke game, really. So we played with Davis and we believe in him. And now it is West Brom, is all we care about. Not that Stoke game, because that Stoke game was two games ago, if we include in this one. That occasion was a whole week ago. Yeah, Stoke game was on the 20th, now we're on the 19th. Whole week ago, we can forget about it now. We had to, to crit tricky start there, but here's Luongo the Chaplin. I'm sure that was Luongo. Woolsey. Woolsey's their defender. Plays it to Noah. We can't quite get the ball from here. Here's Luongo. Luongo wins it back again. Luongo feeds Burns. Burns turns, Burns shoots, Burns scores. Burns. Opens the scoring at the Hawthorns. That's the stadium. That's Bournemouth, mate. Come on. He actually tries to go wild because they know Hawthorns is a tough place to come. And in real life, we were 1 0 down at this point. And obviously, this is. Post Leeds game, so was the um, last episode, which in, which wasn't so good performance. But here's the dapper. We're not worried about real life. We're worried about this career mode. I need to find this career mode. It's nearly as good as real life. Chaplin to the dapper, and the dapper scores twice. I can't believe it. 
We are looking so sharp. And yeah, maybe. Um, right. We're looking at transfers here. I don't know why. How, what, who? Okay. So we're just looking at these transfers now. Um, but yeah. Because obviously we are struggling. I know I've put this in at a really awkward time because there is gameplay to come after this, which is the um, West Brom game. But I know you've lots been waiting for this. We're looking at players and we're looking at signing them. I know you lot have been dying to know who we're going to sign. So, yeah. I, I know it's been putting an awkward time in the middle of the game. But, hey. Does it matter? No. Because we were going to win that game anyway. I just wanted to put that out there. We won that game 5-1. But I don't know where all the footage has gone for that one. Because obviously I've it's, it's been lost in the because obviously recording from an Xbox is not the best quality I know, but it's what we have to deal with, boys. And it's still the best career mode in in the world. Not in the mm, yeah 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 I'll stick by that. Best career mode in the world. But no, definitely best Ipswich career mode in the world. Um and yeah. So I'm quite a solid team here against Cardiff. Cardiff. Burns already cuts it back to Perry and G, who clears it, who we did scout. Perry and G, we are scouting. Um, oh yeah. Romeo. I honestly. This is because I feel I'm recording it live through my voice. But here we go. Wardhead. Cross it over. Oh. Well. Um. I'm not sure I meant to do that. Oh, I remember what. I'm playing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, that's what happened. Okay. But here's hers. He scores. We're not going to reset the match now, I don't think. Because this is just open this game. No, it's all right for reset the match. We were literally going to nil. I think what I meant to do there is stop the video. To be honest, I remember that happening now. Um, but yeah. Hurst opens the scoring. That's 1 0. Come on. But yeah, um, as I said, it's been obviously watch recorded live, so I don't know what's coming up next. To be honest with you, over oh, here's Hanarski makes a good save. Grant, Tanner, Grant, Hanarski can't save that one. Chaplin plays the Davis. Leaf Davis gets his first goal for town. This season, that is just superb. I'm so happy for him. Wow, wow, wow. I think he's the first defender to score in the career mode as well. Don't quote me on that. That's a brilliant run and it's a brilliant goal. But yeah, as I was saying, it's been recorded live, voice recorded live, and then West Bomb Crips could c creep up at any point. But yeah. As as I said, boys, we just we just improved that haven't we? That's a penalty, boys. Come on. We are just simply the crew modes will improve over time. I know it's my like, it's a travel club and it's a sort of I'd like a trial crew mode. But it's still gonna be a proper crew mode. Each episode I'm trying to get better and better, but Broadhead scores out of the pen. Lovely off the I'm, I'm, I'm off the post. But yeah. As I said, um, try to get some better in there. And if, if, I, if I can have your support, that's all I can ask for, you know. 
If you just click that like button. Share, like anything, man. It means the world to me. My th oh, it's a, good, it's a good shot by Chaplin. Water crosses in. Hurst. The game's blocked out for a corner. But as I said, if you just, like, if I get 10 views, I'm over the moon. Hurst. Williams! <laughs> oh my word! Brandon Williams! That is just sensational! Um, wow! Wow, wow, wow! That is quite clearly a goal. Because that crossed the line. But, wow! That is superb from Brandon Williams. Right place, right time. Gets his first goal for town. And this, this looks like a very good game for town fans. Here's, oh, 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 I asked I asked for twenty five subscribers at the end uh, beginning of the video. If I can get um twenty five subscribers by maybe February. Maybe then if I get it by the end of the year. I don't know what I'd do. I know it's only eight subscribers but for me that's huge. Because I'm trying to I don't know. I'm trying to make something out of this YouTube channel. And not it just being mean like other people make it out to me. And my people that were up and coming, hopefully, I'm, and I'm big up myself a lot here, but up and coming YouTubers, um, just, oh, his, oh, but just, like, keep on looking forward, don't look back. You started something. And you'll see clearly wants to do it. His chaplain broadhead follows in. 5 2. But yeah, just chase your dreams, man. Chase them. Chase your dreams. You know, your dreams can never, ever, ever be stopped. And they can only be stopped by you. So that's my advice for anyone that wants to do anything, whether it's being a footballer or. Even being a binman, like, I know it sounds funny, but that could be someone's dream. And, you know, I think just being that, being sort of, being resilient is really important if you want to do anything in life. And if you're believing and you're willing to put in the effort anything can happen. Honestly, this isn't... I'm only 14, like... This isn't a job for me at the moment. It's something I do in my spare time. But that's a lovely finish from Broadhead. Let's see what's the career mode now, because that's enough speaking about irrelevant stuff. But the career mode is what we care about. And the career mode is what you're here to watch, and not hear me here speaking about random stuff. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, team management. We're gonna change some subs. Ladapo coming on. Flying past defenders, scoring one or two. Looks good. Looks good. Looks fine. Looks fine. Oh, Ladapo's on my mind. I need to push number nine. Dum 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 But yeah, he's Chaplin running through. Chaplin could get his goal for town. Connor Chaplin, baby, on his left foot, which he scored so many goals with last season in real life. I does it again, and this career mode does make me shiver. And this career mode makes you feel some type, certain type of ways, not in a weird way at all. Just don't 
No, no. <laughs> Yeah, it just makes you feel, it just makes, makes you feel absolutely lovely this grammar. I'm not sure about you lots, but yeah, I'm enjoying it. Here's Egg Ball. Clark, running down the line, plays the Hutchinson. Plays it wide. Hutchinson needs his goal, man. That would be brilliant. He scored two in real life already. If Chaplin. Could it be 7 2? The Dapo! The Dapo makes it 7 2 against Cardiff at home. That is a massive result. Massive for the goal difference. And massive for town. I don't think we need to show much more. We're clearly, clearly the winners of this game. Somehow they find. Five goals in no, <laughs> five goals in five seconds. It's not possible. <laughs> like even if you play an under three team, you'd still not against prime Real Madrid. That still wouldn't happen. Only behind. Come on. So I'll be. But yeah, as I said, we might see Walton in the next few weeks. But we do make a transfer here. And if you're if you pay attention to it, it was last season the FA Cup, you'd know this man. It's a South African striker from Burnley. Ladies and gentlemen, you know who it is. It was one of the most up and coming strikers of Burnley. Lyle Foster, baby. London for a season. Big signings for a big team. Come on, man. Obviously, the next few episodes are going to be playing a lot more games because and um, because of there's no more transfer window. And this is deadline day. We're on. So, yeah. Lyle Foster, two at Town. Big money moves for Town. The depot comes out of the squad for Foster. He slots right in there for a 70 weight striker for the Town. And there, that is our listed. Jackson, La Dapo. I, if there's one player I didn't want to lose, that is Fridge. Because I love Fridge. In real life and in career mode, I loved Fridge. I know he scored an own goal. That don't matter. That don't matter. Right. This. We're going to make one more sign in this video. Um, and. Yeah. But the Dapper will make mine govern. Because he needs more games if Foster's come in. Um, obviously Evans gets a lot of injuries in real life. But yeah, this next signing right here. Right now. If you pay attention to what we can do on the transfer list. A centre back from the Premier League, 20 years old, you'd know who he is. He's currently with a person with a full kit on. He definitely isn't a player. If he was any player, he would be. Mm, I don't even know. I think that would be to be honest. Matt Holland? No, Matt Holland doesn't know that. But it is Joel. No, Joe. Jo, Jarrell Quenza. Sorry for the pronunciation, but I can't. Jarrell Quenza from Liverpool. B rating for that transfer. And that is big. We've still got Stansfield and Perry and G maybe to come in January. But yeah, that is a big episode from us. Jackson, we've accepted a bid for him. But because there was only an hour left of the transfer, there is only... But this is, this is what happened. Billy Evans left for a million. Humphrey left on loan to Elche. Foster came in and the GOAT. Um, 
Jaden Broth came in. So, yeah. That is about it for the window. Next episode, we've got Watford. Next episode, we've got QPR away. And then, to finish off with a home game, Hull City. We might not have Baggett, to, to be fair. Nah, Baggett, Baggett's too important. Baggett, I think, in real life, I'm speaking real life here, he is better. He may be better on, on a good day, he's better than um, Fridge. So, yeah. This is the end of episode um, things. We've got 8 out of 20 for chap, kind of chapstick baby, and 3 out of 15 for midfield maestros. The midfield dominance, not. Uh, should be Mr. Maestros, actually. So, yeah. Come on, the boys. Right, how did you enjoy that one? Big 7 2 win at the end. I don't know how that happened. Um, obviously, I did say the footage got lost for, I don't know how, from the Xbox network, from their goal, which was unbelievable. Probably goal of the episode. But, um, yeah. Put in the comments if you want to see the player in the episodes, because it might be a good idea, it might not. It depends on what you, want, you guys want to see. Um, and, yeah, see you lot. I might, I might have one out on Christmas Day because it's New Year's Eve now. New Year's Eve, Merry Christmas. Um, yeah, it's New Year's Eve. And, uh, no, not New Year's Eve. What am I saying? Christmas Eve. And see if you want an episode out on Christmas. And it might be out or it might come to Boxing Day. So, yeah. See you lot in the next one.